Today we have the new Moultrie Mobile Edge cellular trail camera. This camera is kind of unique in the fact that I think it's the first camera that I know of that doesn't require an SD card. Everything is stored internally and it's sent to a cloud and it has unlimited storage so every picture this camera ever takes will be available to you via the Moultrie Mobile app. It also has built-in SIM cards, so you don't need to choose AT&T, Verizon, T-Mobile, whatever, whatever it may be. This will automatically connect to the strongest service in your area. They've got affordable plans starting as low as $8.99 a month. Included with those plans, you get activity charting, species recognition, weather data, interactive maps and like I mentioned before the unlimited cloud storage and again they mentioned that Moultrie Mobile will not delete your images even if you cancel your plan uh, what are they telling us they've got up to 33 megapixel resolution 720p video 0.85 trigger speed and an 80 foot flash range no more SD cards, improved battery life, will run on 8 or 16 AA batteries. Also compatible with a 12 volt, either a solar panel or an external rechargeable. So, let's pop it out of the box here. Here's what you get in your box. Scan your code, add your camera to your account, install your batteries, press connect to take a test image. So we're going to test this out and see if it's as simple as Moultrie claims it is. There's the camera itself. One single latch. It's got the threaded insert on the back as well as the threaded insert on the bottom. There's your port for your 12 volt. Latch is easy to pop open. Not much on the inside. Uh, they seems to be the trend of cameras. They're keeping it simple with no internal viewers. Uh, it obviously cuts way down on cost. I was a little skeptical when the first few cameras came out without the internal viewers, you know, as far as setup. But quite honestly, I have not had any issues with, with cameras of this design. They seem to connect and do everything you want through the app, you change your settings through the app, take test pictures, uh, everything is done through the app. Battery trays on the bottom, eject button here. There's your eight batteries on one side, eight on the other if you choose. There is the orange o-ring, keeps moisture, water, bugs. I've never had issues with Moultrie cameras as far as moisture or, or anything like that getting inside of them. Uh, they seem to be pretty watertight. This one is not deer hair tight. So, I'm going to put the batteries in. I'm going to go with 16 Moultrie alkalines. I highly recommend running an external or solar panel with any cellular camera. Um, cellular cam cameras are pretty hard on batteries no matter what batteries you use. You'll get better life with lithiums, but again, if you're going to be running multiple cellular cameras and you don't want to be in the area disturbing the camera, you want it to run for an extended time, put a solar panel on it or put an external 12 volt. Um, it's going to save you money in the long run, a little bit of cost up front. I obviously I already have a Moultrie Mobile account but if you didn't you would download the Moultrie Mobile app and you would choose to activate a new camera. Slide these back in here. That's 
that's it. At this point, when you have the Moultrie app downloaded and you have uh, click on activate a new camera, you're going to scan that QR code. Very simple. Your camera on most modern phones will scan that. If you do have issues, there is a support number to call. I've never had issues. They scan the code. It asks you what plan you would like to use and you're on your way. Turn the camera on. I don't know if you can really tell, but it's got the uh, connecting, connected, not connected. So it will flash a little bit here shortly. Right now it's trying to connect to the server. It's got a battery life indicator, which isn't an addition that is nice. A lot of the cameras without the internal viewer also have no battery indicator. So boom, within, within 30 seconds we're connected. I can close the camera, set it up wherever I want to set it up. It's also got the uh, antenna already connected. You don't have to do anything as far as putting an antenna on. Depending on where you're at, I like to leave the antennas down. If you still get a good service, uh, just keeps them out of the way, keeps uh, animals from tugging on them. And uh, with that, we're sending pictures. Um, very simple setup. I had this up running within five minutes. We've got, uh, I got a notification just now, we've got a picture to the app already. All your changes will be done on the app, depending on what amount of pictures you want per trigger, uh, the time between triggers, resolution, uh, video, picture settings, everything's done via the app. You can also choose to have your pictures sent immediately. You can have them cho choose to send every three hours, every six hours, 12 hours, and I think 24 hours is the options Moultrie gives you. Uh, the less frequently you send pictures to the app, the better battery life you're going to get. The connecting to the servers and sending the pictures is what really drains the batteries on a cellular camera. I, for testing, I will put this in my yard um, just to get my backyard deer and I'll have the pictures sent immediately just to see how it does, see how the battery life is. But once I put this in the field, I'll, I'll choose to have it send pictures twice a day. So that's kind of it in a nutshell. The camera is a little bit thick and that is only because of the extra battery space to run on to run 16 batteries. I have no problems with that. You know, it's it's stout. It seems to be a, a pretty good design. Uh, again, I've never had issues with Moultrie as far as any kind of leakage or, or that kind of thing. So what we'll do is we'll get this out in the backyard. I've got some uh, some backyard deer that come in the yard every night and uh, we'll, we'll get some test pictures and we'll keep you guys updated on how it does with picture quality, how it does with battery life, and obviously how it does with longevity. Again, Moultrie Mobile Edge, new cellular camera from Moultrie. This camera also, I should mention, retails for $99. It, for a you know, cellular camera, that's a great deal, um, affordable. You can get yourself one of these. You can get two or three of these if you want to monitor property. You can also use these for security. If you have something around your house, around your farm, around your gates that you want to keep an eye on, these are great tools. Get them up high. Get them out of the line of view of people and trespassers. Uh, I use a few of these myself just for that purpose. So, again, thank you for watching. And we will keep you updated on how this one does.